go. We just woke up. There's Drew watching. Well, messing with my deodorant. She sees me put it on every morning, so she wants to put it on. Um, and she's watching Peppa Pig on my laptop. We haven't been up for long. I literally just made her um some little sausage things. And I haven't look, I haven't even brushed my teeth yet. But I haven't um hopefully you can hear me. Let me turn this down a little bit. <clears throat> I decided to film, no, put that back, to film a day in the Puppy. life kind of thing, I guess, because I was going to do a weekend routine, but mm, it's not really a routine. A routine would have to be morning wise because, you know, the weekends change up, but, um, so I'm going to do a day in the life. I wish I had thought of it earlier, but really all I have to do is I woke up last night, which was Friday night, today's Saturday. She, um, we fell asleep in the bed together. I had got off work. I literally got off work, just took off my bra, or whatever, <laughs> and lay down in the bed with her. Well, we ate, you know, we did a few things, and I was just so tired that I laid down in the bed with her. We laid down together like at 7 30, and she watched Peppa Pig on the laptop, and I ended up falling asleep on her, and I think she fell asleep with me. And we both slept in my bed tonight. Well, last night. So, I woke up this morning. And, yeah, I woke up first because I had to go to the bathroom. And I woke up um, close to 8. And what time is it now? Because I woke up close to 8. And you want what? You need a band-aid? Okay. I'll get you one. So, I woke up close to 8. And um, I went to the bathroom and they kind of woke her up. But I literally laid in the bed, just I'm playing on my phone, and then I texted a few of my friends, trying to see if they want to do a play date today, because I don't really have anything planned for us today. Um, nor do I really have many ideas. I mean, I kind of want to go to Walmart, but it's not pressing like I have to go. I just kind of don't want to go. And I went to Target. Oh, I do need to go to Target. Well, not need. When I say I need to go somewhere that's shopping, I don't need to. I want to go. I kind of want to go to Target because I spent like $80 there last weekend and I got a $5 gift card for that. Um, So, I kind of want to do that. So, we may end up going shopping later on today. Um, I'm trying to see if we can get a play date going with someone, but... I don't know if it's too early and no one hasn't texted me back yet, but I feel like most of the moms would be up, you know, but yeah, no one has really responded in regards to that. Um, the only people that have responded are like two of my friends with no kids. Um, and she's going to the mall. So I guess we could still go to the mall and I just, you know, push journey in her stroller or something, but I prefer to hang up with somebody that has kids just so their journeys entertain. And I know that being a person that doesn't have a child, you know, they could get more frustrated or, you know, I just feel like a fellow mom will understand hanging out with a child more and not get as frustrated or have more patience, you know, just more understanding about, you know, just being out with the child. But my friend is very supportive. She's a good friend. And when we hang around, um, hang out and journeys around like she never has a problem with it or whatever but you know I just don't want to put that on anybody you know but um yeah so we don't have any plans so it's just kind of a go feel as you go thing and even if we don't hang out with anyone I'm still thinking about maybe just taking her to the park or walking around the park or just getting out to do something but also at the same time I need to clean up. Downstairs doesn't look as bad. I just need to wash a few dishes. Well, I started the dishwasher this morning, but I have a few pots um, that I need to hand wash because I don't put pots in the dishwasher. Um, yeah, and Jordan just had like two sausage patties for breakfast. I'll show you those. Um, probably insert a clip now while I'm talking. How I did that because I just now started like thought of to start a video but if I had thought of that at first I would you know 
it would have made more sense. But anyways, so that's pretty much all we've done. And then I went downstairs. I made her those two sausage patties. I made me a cup of coffee. And I had a little breakfast biscuit oat thing. I'll show it to you. Um, and that's what I had for breakfast with coffee. And she just had two sausage things. And she had a little bit of water. So that's all she did. We came back upstairs and she's been watching Peppa Pig on the laptop. And I was watching YouTube videos, trying to get some ideas of things we could do today. Like I bought some little activity books that I wanted to start doing with her. And I got that idea from Raven Elise TV. Um, cause she does like homeschool stuff with Zaya, which is her three-year-old. She's a taller, she's almost the same age as Journey. So it just kind of gave me an idea of some things to do with her. But at the same time, I feel like those books I may just want to keep for like during the week things. And then, like, give both of us a break on the weekend. So, I don't want us to, you know. And it's something you have to do in the house. We can't really, like, go out and do it. You know what I mean? Anyways. So, that's what we're doing now. That's what we've been doing. And it just turned 10 o'clock. So, we've probably been doing that for, like, an hour now. And I just decided, hmm, let's film a video. I want to get my toes done. I know I'm probably going to polish Journey's toes or something. But, yeah, I need to take a shower. And I always try to take my showers um, while she sleeps. So I'll either wake up earlier than her or wait till she goes to bed because she always wants to get in the shower with me. But I may just let her get in with me if I have to because I need to yeah. take a shower. Like I said, I just passed out last night. So, like, I definitely need a shower. Um, What you doing, boo? Hey, what you got? Uh, I take you back, baby, bathtub. In the bathtub? Uh-huh. Okay, say hey to the camera. Hey, to camera. Say what you doing? Hey, I was doing That's a potato. Potatoes. Yeah, I see it. Oh, hair. Yeah. It don't go in your hair, boo-boo. Huh? It does not go in your hair. How do I eat? It's a potato brush. I don't want to let her play with it because it was only a dollar. But it's supposed to be to wash her potatoes. And she thinks it's a toy. Like, but anyways. So, I think we're going to go ahead and get up now. Um, I think I'm going to start off by taking a shower. Probably let her take one with me. We're going to get ready together. Brush our teeth. Um, if you've ever watched my morning routine videos. Or have ever heard me talk about getting ready in the morning. I do not brush my teeth before I eat in the morning. It, the only time I would do that is if I know that I'm going to wait 30 minutes or, you know, yeah, or I know that I'm going to be waiting some amount of time bef uh, after I brush my teeth to eat because you're supposed to wait 30 minutes, you know, after you use mouthwash to eat and stuff. Um, so I know that when I first wake up, if I'm going to be like hungry or whatever, I just eat first and then brush my teeth. Like, I don't rinse my mouth out or something like that, but I always brush my teeth after I eat. And I'm kind of training her to do the same thing because it, it doesn't make sense to brush your teeth and then eat immediately after because you're not supposed to do that. It's just my thing. It's just how I feel about it. I know everybody don't agree with it. Like, my sister, you know, you know, they just, as soon as you wake up, you just brush your teeth and then they eat. I don't do that. It, I don't. You know, it's it's a controversial thing, okay? To each his own. This is just how I like to do it. And I'm training my child to do it the same way. Um, the only like I said, the only time I do is if I know that I'm going to for sure wait thirty minutes. And if I wake up hungry, that means I'm not gonna wait thirty minutes after I brush my teeth to eat. So I'm gonna eat first and then brush my teeth. <laughs> I know that's weird. But anyways, yeah, we're gonna go ahead and get ready. And I think after we get dressed, I'm just gonna probably let her play a little bit i might even polish her toes and make her sit in while i try to clean up a little bit because like i said downstairs is pretty good i just need to wash a few dishes but upstairs is where the mess is like my room my room is a mess yeah and so let's get started i don't know how the day is gonna go this is gonna be just a go with the flow thing and i need to shave my armpits y'all see that peach fuzz oh i have not want it it's bad when i get in camera too look at it that's terrible don't look at it that way yeah i need to shave my armpits so i am ready let's do this 
Good morning. Okay, let's go potty. Let's go potty. And, you know, excuse the mess in the house. Party. So we're both gonna party and then brush teeth. Yeah, Show them you can wash your hands. Oh, oh, it's cold. Show them you know how to wash your hands, okay? Get some soap. Get some soap. Can you show the camera you can wash your hands? Show the camera, please. Mm. Oh. Ooh. Oh, crap, 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 crap. Is this possible? Mm -hmm. The camera wants to see you wash your hands. Mm. Right here. It's not soap. This is not a It's just soap. Okay, Sarah. Journey, the camera wants to see you wash your hands. See, look. As you can see, getting her to wash her hands was a bit of a struggle, but so was getting her on the potty. I just did not include the part, but you know, some mornings are just more difficult than others, and that's just life when you have a toddler. Um, so now we're going to go ahead and get her to brush her teeth, and um, we just use the kids' crest toothbrush. I said toothbrush, toothpaste. And I just get like the key size two brushes. This one's just a little, I think it's a minion one. But I, I buy different kinds all the time. I switch our toothbrushes out every three months. But she's so like reckless with her stuff that I probably give her a new toothbrush like once a month. Just because the toothbrush will end up in the toy box, down the drain, in the trash. If you have a two-year-old, you know what I'm talking about. So, yeah, you see me struggling with her, trying to get her to brush her teeth. She doesn't want to open her mouth. Some mornings, she wakes up, and she's just, like, perfect. <laughs> like, we can do the whole routine, like, fast and get it over with. And then there's other mornings, like this morning, where it's a struggle. And, you know, it takes me, like, 30 minutes to get her to open her mouth and brush her teeth. Which is why I'm so glad, so thankful that I have my mom. Because on mornings, like when I wake up or if I don't have enough time to like spend 30 minutes, um, you know, trying to get her to brush her teeth. Um, I can just send her toothbrush and toothpaste over my mom's house and she'll just brush them there. She already has a spare over there. And I also have a little Ziploc bag of Kiss toothpaste and her toothbrush. In her um, little bag that she takes. It's not really a diaper bag anymore. She wears pull-ups. But it's her little bag that I have for her. It looks like a little, um, I don't know what to call it. Like book bag kind of thing. But it's small for her size. Um, she just takes a few pull-ups in there. Spare clothes. And I put her a little Ziploc of toothbrush or whatever. Tooth stuff. Tooth care in there. And if you guys want to see, like, what all do I keep in her bag now that she's two and not really in Pampers, let me know. I'll do a whole video on that. But I'm just brushing my teeth as well. And I just use a Colgate. Um, I think this was the enamel or something. It just switches up sometimes. And she also uses the Kids Crisp mouthwash as well. And I love it. Her breath really does smell like bubblegum afterwards. Um, so I like it for her and she also knows not to swallow and she uses uh, floss picks as well I just have like the kids size and I'm using the nine day math wash that I just shows you and it's okay I don't really like it it's one of those math washes that like leave a film in your mouth um, and I had to go get her a little washcloth she has her own washcloths and towels that i wash with her stuff like i wash her stuff separate like all of her stuff separate from mine and the main stuff like the main towels and everything um just because i use different um detergent for her i don't want anything that's going to irritate her skin i'm um, going to also use these like baby cotton swabs so they don't go too deep in her ear but yeah back to the audio 
And I'm just wiping the counter stuff off because she made quite the mess. Journey. The see those pretty chops. Say cheese. Cheese. Did you brush your teeth? Uh -huh. Good job. I don't know how I missed this spot. Come on, let's show them your room. Can you show us your room? Show the camera your room. Okay. There you go. Say follow me. Wow. It's messy. What a messy room. I'm tripping over stuff now. So, I already have an outfit out here. I wasn't sure which one I wanted her to wear, but um, I think I'm gonna put this on her. But I have this second outfit out here too, because I think this one may be a little too big, but we're gonna try it out. Yeah, I'm trying not to get the bottom half of her because she doesn't have on any underpants. So yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and get her dressed and get myself dressed. And then um, um, I need to clean up her room. So if I have time still after getting this both dress, I'm gonna come clean her room up. And then what am I gonna do after that journey? I'm gonna come and clean her room up. I'm just grabbing the pull up here. And um, I have no idea what I'm saying. <laughs> I swear it's like mommy, mommy brain. And then I just got all these. I was looking for, I think I'm gonna get um, a bin. Actually, she has an extra bin. Well, she did have an extra bin up here. Or organize it in these drawers somewhere. I don't know how I'm gonna do this, but I need to do a little organization in her room. But I'm just gonna get some lotion to freshen her up with. Um. Use this one, just so she smells fresh. And her clothes and her shoes. I'm just grab these sandals up here because I'm not sure if she has some other ones somewhere else. Um, and I do need to get her hair stuff as well. I think I may just do one simple ponytail. on the floor. She just drew stuff all over the floor. I think I'm just going to do one simple ponytail and we usually get dressed on my bed. Well, I get her ready on my bed because it's more spacious. Or when her room is actually clean, I'll get her dressed on her bench in her room. Which is right there. It's filled, filled up with junk. So, I'm going to get dressed. Oh, I forgot she do not have on any pants. <laughs> Turn. I'm gonna break my neck if you don't get this stuff out of the way. <sighs> I almost had a slip and fall accident. But yeah, this is the bench that I usually get her dressed on. And she has put something on there right there. I don't know what that is. Looks like diaper cream. But yeah, it's filled up with junk, so I can't get her dressed in here. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna get us dressed and I need to do her hair. I think I'm just going to actually just do one simple ponytail and put like a bow on it. That's what I think I'm going to do. <sighs> so I'll just gather everything I need to get her ready and myself. You see that? I used the uh, uh, Mr. Clean eraser because she drew all over <laughs> the wall. So this is what I have for her. And I just need to find her bow. I took it off last night and I probably placed it in some random spot. I think this is the, I don't have my glasses on. So I can't see very well. So I'm just gonna brush her hair back up into my ponytail, get her dressed, get me dressed. I'm just gonna wear jeans and a shirt because it's a very casual come as you are church. And after that, I'll see if she's hungry. If not, I'm going to finish you in dress. I don't think I'm going to wear any makeup today because my face has been like breaking out lately. So I'm probably not going to wear any makeup. Um, so it's going to be pretty simple. You ready? Morning routine. 
But yeah, let's just follow along with the steps. So I'm just using the Baby Johnson's Justin and Johnson's baby lotion. Um, and I use it to keep our skin moisturized, but most importantly, I use it for the smell. And I've heard of something called baby cologne that's apparently at Walmart, but it's not at my Walmart. And I haven't seen it yet, but that's usually what I use it for is just to put a really good scent on her because she does go to like the children's section in my church. And if she ever does have an accident or if they have to undress her for whatever reason i would prefer that she smells nice um so i'm still looking for the baby cologne i may have to end up ordering it online but yeah that's why i use the johnson's lotion because it has a nice scent and it also keeps her skin soft and right now i'm currently using the just for me hair products as you can see it's a struggle with this as well like I said, some days she'll sit and let me do her hair and there's like no problem. And then other days it's a problem. This particular morning, she just did not want to get ready at all. She didn't want to brush teeth. She didn't want to wash her face. She didn't want to wash her hands. She didn't want to go potty. She didn't want her hair brushed. I don't even think she wanted to put her clothes on. It was just one of those mornings for her and she's too. And some mornings are just like that, you know. But like I said, I'm using the Just For Me products. I use the Detangling Spray and I also use the uh, Curl Defining Cream. And it's the Just For Me Keys. I was a really big Shea Moisture Fanatic for her as far as like her hygiene products for her body and hair. But I wanted to try some different things now that she's getting a little older. The Shea Moisture works just fine. But I just want to just try things just because I like to try stuff. <laughs> but yeah. Um, and so far I do like the Just For Me. So I just brushed her hair up in a simple ponytail. Put a little bow on there. And I'm putting on her little jelly bean sandals. I think I got these sandals from Walmart for like $5. So if you have a taller girl that needs shoes, get those. Show them your hair. Show them your hair. So look at my hair. It's our hair. So do you like it? We like it. Yeah, we love your hair, Jerry. I like it too. What color is your hair bow? Purple. Yeah. No, your hair bow is pink. I mean, now your hair bow is white. <laughs> Show me your white hair bow. Okay. Ooh, pretty. She's trying to show you her hair. Good job, mama. Are you Trying to see how you can see my bra through here if it looks really, really bad or not. If I need to put on the undershirt. It looks okay. So, Journey's ready. Hey. She's looking cute. Mama looks a little ratchet. But, I'm just gonna brush my edges and do my wash and go. Let my wash and go down at this pineapple. And I think we're running a little low on time because the maintenance man did a surprise visit. My tub was leaking. Um, you okay? Uh -huh. My tub was leaking yesterday. And I called them to come yesterday and it was an emergency maintenance because a part of the ceiling actually collapsed. I'll insert a clip if you guys really want to see it. I'm telling you, I'm not making this up. But they were supposed to come yesterday and no one ever came. So he came and uh, yeah, it was just an unexpected uh, visit because I wasn't planning on him coming but yeah now i'm just gonna fix my hair up and then we'll be headed out the door because i think we're running late yep it's time for us to go luckily we only live five minutes down the street but yeah so i'm gonna use this red can diamond oil shatterproof shine you can't really see the words and it has a little dropper but i would think i, I think i would only ever use that dropper on my straight hair just because it's like not enough for my curly hair. Get the hairbrush, Journey. Get the hairbrush. Bring me the hairbrush for mommy's hair. <sighs> yeah, I told her to go get the hairbrush off my bed. She's at the age now where I feel like she can comprehend certain things. So when I can 
and their simple task I like try to delegate them to her so she can learn how to do like things and have chores get the hairbrush boo well she don't feel like getting the hairbrush and actually it's still laid down a little bit from yesterday Mommy. which I just Mommy. did this wash and go yesterday so it Mommy. should be so I'm not gonna worry about gelling down my edges but that's it we're gonna head out the door I'm gonna grab a shake and a cup of coffee and see if she wants anything and then we're out of here okay Jen time okay so here's my cup of coffee that I took to church with me and we are allowed to have drinks in the sanctuary um, I'm just using a Starbucks uh, reusable uh, coffee cup but um, it's not actually Starbucks I just made it out of my Keurig this is what my hair turned out like um, so yeah I'm just gonna enjoy our church service and for future Sunday vlogs, if you guys, guys would like me to include like what the message was for this Sunday or something like that, just let me know. But I hope you guys liked it and I think I may want to do more Sunday vlogs in the future. So yeah, stay tuned and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.